Well, what's up guys, Intellitech Studios here, and just a quick video. I vacuumed earlier today with a Sharp Stratos, and I figured I would give the carpets a bit of a deeper clean, so I grabbed my Bissell Clean View One Pass Multi-Cyclonic, the 9595A, that I bought quite a while ago, a couple years ago actually, and I only used it once whenever I first got it. I used it on a really messy job cleaning up a friend's trailer at the time, and I haven't really used it much since then. I cleaned it out, refurbished it. I used it once in my living room already. You can see the results of that. Got some fluff in the bin and some other junk. So we're gonna see what else this can do. What the fuck? Sorry, one of my friends just came downstairs and just absolutely scared the daylights out of me. So, we'll get back to it. Ow! Shit. Okay, let me put this. There we go. Keep that out of the way. And we'll try again. <laughs>
All right. A lot more hair and fluff and junk in there. So that's all. That's all good. So that's the clean view. Did a pretty good job. This is probably my favorite of the modern clean views. The Cyclone setup is much better than the previous clean views, like the Clean View, Clean View 2, Clean View Helix, which I guess the Clean View Helix would be considered a Clean View 3. This would be like the fourth generation clean view. And then there's the fifth generation, which is basically identical to this, but it has a larger brush roll window. It's orange usually, and it has the 8 amp motor instead of the 12. This is one of the last Bissells they produced with a 12 amp motor. I believe the actual last was the Power Groom Multicyclonic, or not Multicyclonic, the Power Groom Bagless. Maybe that had a 10 amp? I can't remember. I think it had a 12, and it might have had a 10. I can't remember. I do have one upstairs, so I could look, but I don't feel like it. Not like it matters. They do still produce 10 amp ones under the Sanitaire in big green name. A lot of debris likes to get stuck up here for some reason. And let's look at the filter. Not too bad, just a little bit of dust. So overall, I'd say that did a pretty good job. I'm pretty satisfied with that result. So yeah, it's the CleanView Multicyclonic model 9595. So that's pretty much that. I will use this a bit more and do a full review on it, even though they discontinued this right after I bought it. So part of the reason why I waited so long to do a review is because second I bought it, they discontinued it, so the review would have been irrelevant, but now I might as well do it. Because um, now it's old enough that it might be considered interesting again. There's some weird stuff on the thing. So yeah, all that is good. So, anyways, this is Intellitech Studio signing out. I'll see you guys in the next video. There's the sticker. And, uh, have a good one.